Um, but today, I think we can say incontrovertibly that, 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 that violent political rhetoric and the threat of political violence in this country comes almost exclusively from the right. They now are the core of the to Fredo. Well, I got to find, well, right, we have the Fredo of the family is the president of the yep. United States. So why doesn't uh, his father take him, or his brother, one of them, take him out for a little uh, fishing? Yes. You know, robot. Yeah, and let him say some Hail Marys. He yeah, loves God so much. Yeah, take him out and, you know, Hail Mary full of grace. God is with you. <laughs> Works for me. Absolutely. Thank, Thank you. you. I don't think I have any Jesse Helms defenders here, Nina. Not <laughs> me. I think he ought to be worried about, the, uh, about what's going on in the good Lord's mind. Because if there's re retributive justice, he'll get AIDS from a transfusion or one of his grandchildren <laughs> will get it. The man is on the court, you know, I hope his wife feeds him lots of eggs and butter, and he dies early like many black men do of heart disease. Oh, but, uh, well, that's how I feel. I mean, I, he, he is an absolutely reprehensible person. You could have went to New Hampshire and killed two birds with one stone. Uh, could have gone to 1600 Pennsylvania and killed the real bird with one stone. Uh, we are here with a very disconcerting questions. Are things in our country so bad that it might actually be time for a revolution? The answer, obviously, is yes. This limbo is beginning to look more and more like Mr. Big. And at some point, somebody's going to jam a CO2 pellet into his head. And he's going to explode like a giant blimp. That day may come. Not yet. I don't we'll, know. We'll be there to know. watch. <laughs> I think he's Mr. Big. I think Yafin Koto. Are you watching, Rush? Yeah, I want you to argue with them and get in their face. Here's the challenge we've, we've got. Uh, the Republicans, they are fired up. They're mobilized. They see an opportunity. Uh, to take back the House, maybe take back the Senate. And if they're successful in doing that, they've already said they're going to go back to the same policies that uh, were in place during the Bush administration. And that means that we are going to have uh, just hand-to-hand -hand combat up here on Capitol Hill. We're not going to be able to keep on making So I know who's asked to kick. Who's asked to kick. Who's asked to kick. I mean, right now I could kill George Bush, no problem. <laughs> No, I don't mean that. I mean, how could you non-violently kill somebody? <laughs> I would love to be able to do that. <laughs>